Hello friends, welcome to the 7th episode of Joomla 2.5 custom template development series. In the previous episode, we have defined this uh, properties like uh, name of the template, author name, author email, version of our template as well as the description of our template. So in this episode, we will define the necessity files and folder and also the module position. So first of all, we have to rename this index.html to index.php. This is vital thing. So let's re rename this file. So index dot uh, html to index dot php. So we have renamed this one. So now um, let's go to the XML file. Now here we have to include each files. So files create a files node. So inside files we will uh, sorry files we will define each file name so file name so what we have to include number one is index.php so let's copy this file name and file name another is file name manifest.xml file name okay next thing so we can individually mention the css and images or we can use the folder so folder images and folder css if you have javascript folder then also you can write and one more thing for uh, prevent directory listing we should create a blank index.html file okay so this is not mandatory but I will suggest that please create this blank index.html file. So now let's copy this uh, index.html file to fair and also this place. Okay so now uh, we will include this external html file. So let's go to the manifest file one more file name. In sorry, index.html. Okay, so we have uh, mentioned our required files. So when we will install this template, Joomla will automatically copy these files and folder to the templates directory. And what will be the template directory name? My template. Okay, so now we have to define defined positions. So, so positions, let's create a node positions yes okay now inside positions we will define different different position so position so now here we will um, write our position name so let's uh, close these things open these things now let's copy the position so first position name was menu area you can give in any order so next one menu button menu button left panel left panel and footer above sorry this one is the actual name footer above we don't need to mention the component position and also the head position okay so we have defined our uh, positions as well as the files okay now uh, we can create our g file and we can install so let's create a zip file so let's review this what we have did so at first we have created our uh, template file uh, using css and html then we have renamed our template file that is index.html to index.php okay and after that we have created a different uh, blank index.html so that um, nobody can list or see our files what are the directory and files present that is not mandatory okay after that we have created this manifest file 
so we have defined the template name author name email and the version of our template description as well as uh, we have included uh, what are the files um, in our template so we have defined using file name and we have um, mentioned the folder using folder tag okay and also we have defined uh, different different positions so we have uh, four position menu area menu button left panel one more position i think we have present that slider area that is my menu menu button okay so let's create a g folder so after that you have to create a g folder so let's create this this jeep can be any name okay so this is our template now uh, this template we can distribute to our friends and to our company or any other thing so that he can install this joomla template so this is our joomla template we can install this template to our joomla back from the joomla backend so thanks for watching and um, if you have any question suggestion please write comment below this video and please subscribe to my channel in the next episode i will install this template to the backend and uh, we will attach different modules to our uh, template position so thanks for watching have a good day